Today we're going to show you how to assemble the 3M TR300 powered air respiratory system. What you have here is the power unit and battery, your air hose, your helmet and a handy carry bag. The VersaFlow system is absolutely ideal for workers who wish to retain their facial hair and it does not require fit testing. It's extremely popular in stone masonry and powder coating. Here we have a M200 series VersaFlow helmet, a visor peel off, and a head pad. First of all, remove the protective cover from the front of the VersaFlow helmet. Remove the adhesive strips from the tear off. Place the tear off in front of the helmet. And then place the head pad on the back of the helmet. Next we'll show you how to connect your VersaFlow battery for charging with its docking station. You have a battery, the docking station and your connection points. Simply take the battery, click in like so, connect your leads, descend into the docking station and this end into a power point. Here we have two lights, orange and green. When charging, orange on and green off means the battery is dead. Orange on, green flashing means almost charged. Orange off, green on means 100% charged. One easy way to check the charge on your battery is to press the test button on the underside here. So here we have the VersaFlow power unit, TR300, the housing, P3 filter, pre-filter, and a spark arrestor. Simply take the housing, place in the spark arrestor, like so, then the pre-filter, the P3 filter itself. Then attach the housing to the unit and you'll hear a click when it's secure. Here we have a fully assembled TR300 power unit and your battery. To attach the battery simply connect onto the bottom like so and you'll hear a click. Here we have the fully assembled TR300 power unit and the belt. I'll show you how to attach the belt to the power unit. Remove all the buckles. Feed the belt through the back of the power unit, like so. And reattach. You have the three main components of your VersaFlow system, your M-Series helmet, your air hose, and the TR300 power unit. To connect the hose, simply insert here, and twist, and the same into the hole the back. To switch on your power unit, simply press the blue button here. And the unit will start up automatically once it's done its battery and filter checks. To increase the airflow, simply press the blue button twice. And same again to reduce.
switch the unit off, just press and hold the blue power button. Once you've assembled your unit, it's ready to wear.